Hi everyone, welcome to my channel and welcome to the much awaited video. So in today's video, I'm going to give you a complete flip through of the Life Aroma Planner 2025. So if you are new to this channel, hi, my name is Aisha and I'm the founder of the Life Aroma and we have recently launched our 2025 planner collection. So just giving you a glimpse of everything we have quickly. So we have two planner cover options to choose from. So these are the two planner cover options that you can go for. The inside contents are definitely the same but the color options are different also we have three sticker books to choose from these three sticker books is all you need to plan your 2025 whether you want to plan functionally or if you want to like decorate aesthetically these sticker books are must have for you but in today's video I'm going to talk about the planner only if you want to check out the flip through of the sticker books it will be coming up super soon and if you want to purchase any of these products this is the website link and I will provide it in the description box below so definitely go ahead check it out now let's get started with today's planner flip through so introducing the life aroma planner 2025 in two cover options so both the planner are hard bound the planner will come in this sturdy box so it has this beautiful floral illustration going on it's a hard bound case it has a ribbon inside that will help you to lift up your planner very easily and these are very sturdy so you can store a lot of stuff here like your stationeries your sticker books even your planner if you want to now let's get started with the planner flip through so i'm just using this particular planner for the flip through but both the content in both these uh, planner cover are exactly the same well firstly let's talk about the outer cover this is in hard bound and in the spine it's written that 2025 is my year i want all of you guys to claim 2025 as that year where you're entering into your new era into your future era you're tapping into your future era so that is the theme for 2025 and most of the prompts that you will find inside the planner focuses on your personal growth journey focuses on building good habits focuses on entering a new version of you so this planner is the perfect one if you want to change your older version and get into a new version of yourself so of course the first page is the planner belongs to page here you can write down your name your phone number in case it's lost moving on is the year at a glance page here you can see 2025 at a glance all the monthly calendar are given here and we have some space here as well where you can jot down important appointments uh, birthdays anniversaries things that you want to like see at a glance here days you want to go for a vacation and all of those stuff can go here if you have exam dates all those stuff can go here even you can use this section to paste a picture like a highlight from that particular month here and see everything here at a glance the next page is where you are claiming 2025 as your year here you can like set your intentions for the year you can choose a theme for the year like a word for the year then you can write down your affirmations and quote that you want to abide by for that particular year also here you can set your habits habits to adopt habits to quit and lastly here we have a section where you can journal to your future self where do you see your future self by the year end you can journal about it here so this particular page is where you claim how you want your 2025 to look like what is the main theme of your life that you want to focus on in 2025 this page is all about that and whenever you are like distracted in the middle of the year you can just come back to this particular page and read about your intentions and the actionable habit plans that you have made for yourself and just get yourself on track moving on we have the famous vision board it's in this beautiful floral theme i really love the way this page has turned out so here you can like uh, represent all of your manifestations your dreams via pictures quotes or even you can just journal whatever way you like to manifest your life you can just go ahead and do this here moving on we have the goal setting page this year i have simplified this particular section so i have divided it into the most important uh, areas of our life which are health and wellness work and career finance and savings personal development relationship and self-care and recreation so you can choose to use this section to set yearly goals in the way you want to you can even write down mini goals here if you want to also one more thing that i want to talk about is the paper quality if you use any pen on top of it first it won't smudge and second it will just pop up like 3d so this whitish paper will make your planning experience more fun and engaging so so yeah that is one thing that i wanted to mention 
Moving on to the next page, here you can write down your morning routine and your night routine. So the concept that I have followed for this year is time blocking. I have given you the time for morning and evening routine and you can just jot down the thing that you want to get done in that particular time block. So just a rough idea of how your morning and your evening routine should look like ideally most of the days where you want to follow all your healthy habits, when you want to work on your goals, when you want to take rest, when you want to rejuvenate. So just make a time blocking schedule here so that you have an idea where you are heading towards and where your time is going in your morning as well as in your evening. Next to that we have two reset checklists which is the weekly and the monthly checklist where very very important to keep your life together so in this weekly research checklist you can make a list of things that you want to do every single week so it can be planning for the next week it can be meal prepping it can be grocery shopping writing down all your appointments so things like that which makes your week sorted and you are like prepared for the upcoming week so mostly i love to do my weekly reset uh, routine on sunday whatever works for you just make a checklist for that so that you can just do it in an autopilot mode just looking at the checklist and you don't have to like spend time uh, thinking about what you want to do in that particular weekend similarly we have a monthly checklist which you can follow on the last uh, day of the month on 30th or 31st so it can be you know paying any bills pending bills it can be planning for the next month it can also be scheduling some self-care appointments in parlor or something like that so whatever is that for you just make a checklist here i will definitely share more ideas on my instagram the next page is a new addition in the life aroma planner which is making your 2025 glow up plan and we have period tracker here as well so I personally feel that this glow up thing is very trending at the moment but uh, it's not about the trend only it's definitely a need of the hour we should definitely glow up physically mentally emotionally in our life that is why I have included this particular page a dedicated page for that so that you are like taking conscious action towards it so we have six categories going on here number one is sleep cycle then movement water and diet skin body care hair care and mental health so what i want you guys to do is write down mini goals that you want to take in this category of your life so for example if we talk about sleep cycle so uh, mini goals can be i want to sleep by 11 pm every single day i want to put away my phone by 9 pm i want to have my dinner by 8 pm so things like that which are like very basic which we should do in our life but somehow we forget about it so things like that and then we have the famous period tracker i've taken feedback from you guys and you wanted a period tracker so we have a dedicated page here and next to this i have added a period self-care checklist we all want to pamper ourselves in those days of the month so definitely make a self-care checklist here like for example i really love to binge watch movies when i'm on my periods i really crave uh, sweets you know like a choco lava cake kind of thing in my period so things like that that you uh that will make you feel good about yourself during those time just make a checklist of that here and yeah just enjoy the process and make it fun moving on we have these two pages the first page is 25 things to do in 2025 so uh, this is kind of a bucket list page here you can jot down places you want to visit books you want to read or maybe things that you want to do any experiences or goals that you want to get done in 2025 you can just make a list here you can just write things down in this box and just color it when it is completed this will look so beautiful by the year end if you have completed this next to that we have a letter to your future self so so this is also a manifestation technique that you can do and here you have to write a letter to your future self talk about your dreams in present tense talk about your experiences how you're feeling living that life all of those stuff you can just write down here i personally do this on the 31st december of every single year and i just come back to this page and read it every single quarter so that i can stay aligned with the future version that i want to become so moving on we have notes pages here so we have two blank dotted grid page which you can utilize in the way you want to i personally will love to use this section along with the level it up sticker book so here we have different matte stickers which i can use so i'm personally going to use these uh, my reading list stickers here and make it colorful and i will just write down the books i want to read so then 
we have movie stickers here mood tracker here for every single month i can make my workout routine here so i will use this particular sticker book to fill up this space and make it colorful so this particular sticker is perfect for someone who don't want to be like very creative but just use stickers and make it colorful and uh, use it functionally so yeah then lastly we have the quarterly planning page uh, so here we have two dedicated page one for reflection and one for planning for the upcoming quarter so here we have the 2024 review page we have some beautiful questions here and just wind down 2024 on a good note and next to that we can plan for the quarter one in the first section you can write down your main goals then we have these three sections where you can break down your quarterly goals and just make a rough idea what you want to do in the upcoming three months months and we have a journal prompt at the bottom which is connected to this quarter planning and we have different questions in each of the quarter so there are hidden questions here and there in this planner which will definitely guide you time and again to keep taking those actionable steps throughout the year so yeah these are all about the yearly pages now we will enter into monthly pages so first let's talk about the monthly dividers so we have these beautiful dividers going on very vibrant and we have a reminder given in each of this divider all these dividers will guide you in some way or the other towards your personal growth journey along with the reminder that is written on it so I'll just leave it to you to unveil the surprise every single month and get motivation next to the divider we have a blank space which you can use in your own way you can write down uh, your notes for that particular month you can make a monthly vision board here or you can like journal whatever you're feeling like you can do that here moving on we have a monthly activity going on every single month for the month of january it is life vision plan so we have three prompts here which you have to answer where do you see yourself in six months, one year and five years from now? So you can just jot down here. So every single month, there are some thoughtful activities going on, which will help you to manifest your dream life. These are not just any random activity you are doing. These have meaningful prompts going on, which will guide you towards your self-love journey, towards your personal growth journey. Now moving on to the first page of January month, where you are going to like start prepping for January. So this page, I personally love to call it my my focus page so here you can set your word for the month kind of a word that will guide you for the entire month to you know keep going you can set your intention for the month and to support that you can write down one affirmation one or two affirmations and a quote for the month and we also have this blank checklist section which you can use to like write down a few motivation things or make a random to-do list kind of a brain dump to-do list or personally what i will uh, suggest is that you can write down a checklist related to the word of the month that you have chosen so, so i personally feel that you have to come back to this particular page every single day to stay aligned to what you want to do in that particular month so keeping it all sync will make sense moving on we have the monthly calendar ample of space to write down stuff here i have kept it very minimally so that you can decorate it with your stickers and the way you want to only we have some floral illustration going on every single month in the side section uh, next to that we have a note section where you can jot down any important notes you want to moving on we have the monthly dashboard section i have simplified this section for you guys so in one page you can write down your monthly goals so we have three goal category given here you can choose your category as per your liking and then jot down your mini goals that you want to follow here for that particular month next to that we have the master to-do list section kind of the brain dump section which is divided into four categories personal self-care work academics reminders and errands or miscellaneous stuff so just jot down your to-do list here for the entire month and organize it in each of the week we have down here we have this currently section which is a new addition in the life aroma planner so basically uh, things that you are reading loving feeling watching manifesting celebrating all of those stuff you can write down here this will act as a memory for you and it will also push you to do something for yourself every single month moving on to the next page we have habit tracker but i have only given three habits to track here because i personally feel personally if you really want to build a habit 
three habits are more than enough to focus on in a particular month i know we all want to develop a lot of habits all together but uh, focusing on very specific habits will help you to build it more faster so that is why three habits i have given and you can also rate those habits so here you can like count and write down the score like out of 31 days how many days you have followed that particular habits that numerical value will give you like a hit whether you are doing good or not so that is why i have added this score section here last year i have added the weekly habit tracker and in case if you want to track anything on a weekly basis you can use up the level it up stickers for that we have these weekly habit tracker that you can use every single week there are a few things that you want to track just for that particular week so in that case you can use that stickers for uh, tracking your weekly habits down here we have budget tracker where you can write down your income savings and expenditures here which is very simplified version and you can use it easily next to that we have the january highlight page and it is labeled from 1 to 31 the basic theme is that you can use this section to write down one thing from each particular day that you want that is the highlight for that particular day you can even use this section to write down what you are grateful for in that particular day moving on we have the famous journaling prompts going on we have different theme going on every single month and this year i have already mentioned that the theme is entering into your new era so every single month you will find different beautiful prompts that will guide you in that process so like for the month of january it is like entering into your future era and we have questions given here based on that now starts the weekly spread so we have vertical layout going on in the life aroma planner and i have simplified the vertical space this year so that if anyone wants to use it for journaling they can do that as well and if anyone want to write down their to-do list and even decorate with stickers and all of those stuff it's like flexibles you can use different stickers colorful pens and just decorate your planner one tip that i can give to uh, anyone who wants to use this planner for journaling instead of writing your journal entries like this you can just write your journal entry this way as well and it will look very pretty when you will like open up and flip through like this like this is just my suggestion one of the pages that i have decorated is this way it will look very colorful since the paper is whitish as, as i have mentioned using stickers and colorful pens will look very vibrant when you when this page will fill up every single week uh, you can write down your goals for that particular week at the top and then we have a vertical layout here which you can utilize the way you want to at the end of the week you can write down highlights and improvement plan for the next week every single week will start from monday on the left hand side i have given this note section where you can jot down any extra notes you can use these stickers like weekly expenses stickers here to just track things for that particular week and yeah you can find a lot of surprises here and there throughout the planner so it won't feel monotonous to you and it will make the whole planning process fun so we have all the weeks going on and and at the end we have the monthly reflection page where you can write down the moments from that particular month things that you have learned what you want to improve for the next month and all of those stuff and you can also rate your month here and then we are ending the month with a notes page which you can use as per your liking so that's all about the monthly spread we have a lot of different prompts going on in each of the month which i won't talk about in details i want you guys to just go through it yourself and look at it and feel good about it yourself and at the back of the planner we have the year end reflection for 2025 which you can fill up and write down your visions for 2026 and we have some notes pages as well we have a lot of note pages in this planner uh, to customize and use it in your own way and lastly i have added a back pocket this was a feedback that i got from last year so we have a back pocket here beautiful back pocket where you can store your stickers and bills and all the stuff that you want to so yeah that's the complete flip through of the life aroma planner i hope you like it and i guarantee you that if you use the planner you will have an amazing planning experience so if you're interested definitely check out our website also there is an announcement more stuff is coming up super soon in the month of november we are launching some new products as well in november so stay tuned for that the products i'm launching are necessity in our life so i feel that you will like it as well i'll see you super soon with a new video let me know what video request you have related to the planner in the comment section i will try to cover it in the upcoming videos i'll see you super soon with a new video till then bye bye